by 2. What is initial velocity, final velocity? Because I have told velocity changes, the first uh, uh, velocity can be called as initial velocity and the last velocity can be called as final velocity. So, uh, if the velocity varies, so the first initial means the starting velocity is initial velocity and final velocity means the last velocity can be called as final velocity. And if you add these two velocity and divide by 2, that is the mean average, then you can call it average velocity. This is the first way by which you can find out average velocity. And the second way is, the second formula or second way of calculating average velocity is like this. Average velocity equal to total displacement by total time total displacement by total time so h average speed if you remember average speed value for uh, the formula for average speed is total distance by total time here average velocity equal to total displacement by total time so it's two formula is there and the formula will be used according to the data given in the question means uh, when numerically you have to solve uh, if you will find out the velocity so according to the data given in the question we can use either of this if displacement is given then you will use this type of this formula and if a question initial velocity and final velocity is given then we can do this formula to find out average velocity so this is uh, all about average velocity so another term the last one that is uh, constant constant velocity or uniform velocity or uniform velocity so what is constant velocity the velocity remains constant it means actually uh, what happens when an object moves in a straight line moves in a straight line why i am telling straight line because when a object travel in a straight line then its direction di does not changes it remains constant the direction will should be same so when an object moves in a straight line and it travels equal distances in equal intervals of time then it is said to be in uniform velocity so here one thing it added that the object should move in a straight line because direction is important for velocity. So to be constant velocity, the object should cover equal distances in equal interval time as well as its direction should not be changed. So if any any moving object, the direction will not change, then you have, it has to travel in a straight line. So when an object moves in a straight line and does not, Oh, sorry, uh, uh, moves in a straight line and covers equal distances in equal interval of time, then it is said to be constant velocity. And if you uh, find out the unit, as I have told, the velocity, constant velocity, average velocity, every velocity has the same SI unit, that is meter per second. So, remember student, this meter per second is the SI unit of both speed as well as velocity so i can say speed average speed constant speed velocity constant velocity average velocity all the six physical quantities have the si unit meter per second okay so this is all about velocity and uh, speed the difference between the speed and velocity and we will discuss about the acceleration in the next session thank you very much for watching this video and if you like this video please subscribe it and give the comments and suggestions thank you